Hello everyone, Frozen Chorus here, and welcome back to some more Final Fantasy 3. In the last episode, we went through the Temple of Time in order to get Noah's loot to wake up this nice old lady here, uh, Une, the Master of Dreams. In this episode, we're finally gonna follow her and uh, make our way to the north to get our new airship, the Invincible. If you're enjoying the series and you want to see more, be sure to leave a like down below and subscribe if you haven't already. Now, before we go up north, let's go talk to her. Uh, how do I talk to people? Oh, I think it's square. I still can't believe that Xander would do this. You have to get the Invincible and stop him as soon as you can. The Invincible is the largest airship that the ancients ever built. Its engine is powerful enough to fly above the highest mountains. Once the Invincible's up and running, you have to find the Fang of Earth. The last, the last fang you'll need to get past Xander's four statues. Now, let's hurry. The Invincible should be in the ancient ruins up north from the shrine I was sleeping in. Alright. Well, that's where we're gonna go. Let's do this. Ah, if I can just... <laughs> oh. Alright, so they said up north. So... Does that mean I have to... Can I fly over there? I feel like I might have to use my rowboat for this if I can reach it. Yeah, hmm. I think, yeah. I think I'm gonna have to do that. Yeah, I'm gonna have to... But I can go from here, right? No? I'll just land right here. There we go. I can... Uh, yeah, okay. Oh, what? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Never mind. I thought I could do that. Can I? No, I can't. Oh, is this it? That's it. I thought I could. I thought I had to. I guess not. All right. Well, ancient ruins. Here we go. Let's talk to Une one more time. Oh, yeah. It's the same thing. Okay. Is this a... It was the same thing. Never mind. All right, let's keep going. Ooh, people. Hello. Uh, we devote our lives to studying the, an the ruins left by the ancients. We recently had a cave-in, and Adamantite is blocking the way further into the caves. Ooh. An Adamantite wall crumbled during the earthquake. Now we've lost contact with the advance team that went deeper into the caves. Huh. Well, that sucks for you. And me. Ew, what is that? Azrael? Well, that's no Prince of... Well, that's no... Archidemon. Well, these guys shouldn't be too much of a problem, I suspect, right? No? I don't know. Good old fire and arrow. Multiply? Are you kidding me? Multiply? Oh, that's annoying. Oh, that's very annoying. So, apparently these enemies can, uh... What's the word? Well, multiply. <laughs> that's... That's a bit annoying. Don't you multiply. Okay. So that's gonna be... So that's good to know. So I guess enemies can multiply? That's, uh... Hmm. I don't know how I feel about that. But I, w I am happy that we all got a level up from that. <laughs> Alright. Alright, Une. Is there something you can do about this? Let me handle this. Striking Dream World stones against any material from this world, even Adamantite, should annihilate both objects. Stand back. Here we go. Ooh. Nice. Oh, she's got dream powers. Nice job. 
Hmm, that was taxing. I sometimes forget my age. <laughs> Come on, don't just stand there. The Invincible awaits. Onwards! Alright, let's go see if we can find those that advanced party too and help them out. But first, let me just check if there's any hidden walls. No, doesn't look like it. Oh, these guys. Do they multiply too? I hope not. <laughs> that would be very annoying if they multiply. If that's the case, I'll just let Lunith just do his thing with uh, Soul Eater. Boop. Oh, they didn't. Oh, they lived? Are you kidding me? Let's try that again. Wait. Let's go for Cura. Uh, let's go for Fyra. And I guess I'll just jump? I don't know. Hopefully they don't multiply too, but... It could happen. No, they didn't. Okay, that's good. So I guess some enemies can multiply. Which is very... which sounds... which is very annoying. That sounds like that's gonna be a pain in the ass, really. Alright, let's go behind this door first. See what's what. Hello, anyone home? No, doesn't look like it. But there is some treasure. Reflect mail. Okay. So we got ourselves some reflect mail, which is good. We could always use more of those. Maybe. Let's see what's up here. Doesn't look like there's anything up here. Oh, more people. Uh, some merchants pilfer weapons and armor from ruins like these and sell them openly. Oh. Every drawing and painting we've recovered has a giant flying ship at its central as its central theme. I get the feeling that something really important is in these ruins. Oh. So is this just like a shop or something? Oh, so it is. Hello. Oh, wow, okay. So it's just a shop at inn. Uh, I don't really need to sleep right now. Hey, that's pretty cool. Okay. Oh, wow, so it is. It is just a sh defender. I was about to buy those. Whoa, jeez. Bloodlands, defender. Okay. Nothing else here? No? Ah, goddammit, I'm stuck in the wall. <laughs> Let's see what's over here. It's probably like armor. If it's good armor, I might buy it. Diamond shield? Woo! I do not have these. Oh, that's very good. Okay. I'm buying those. Better armor for my mages? Hell yes. Oh yeah, there we go. Whoops. There we go. Nice. Okay, well aside from that, uh, not very, very, very helpful. Alright, so I guess, I guess now we can go to this side, because there is something over here. Alright, deeper into the ruins. Uh, that's really, really good. Ooh, fork in the road. There's more forks. Okay. <laughs> I don't know where to go. Oh, no. Hello, Derpy Dragon. Pyrolysis, or whatever that is. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to do to you, but... I wonder if I could turn you into a toad. Maybe prevent you from doing whatever you're going to do to me. Probably not. Oh. Oh, Une's doing something. Haste. Who are you giving that to? Better not give it to my mage. Okay. Oh, you could just give it to everybody. Okay. Okay. That's actually very helpful. Oh, it just died to one sh- Alright. Ooh. That was a lot of experience. That was 36. That was 3600 experience. You know what I could do with that? <laughs> That's so good. Let's see what's in here. Ooh, Black Belt Gi. 
If only I had a black belt. <laughs> Damn it. Man, so many good items from, like, black belts and stuff. Let's go up here, see what's what. Uh, ooh, a chakra band. Another black belt thing. Wow. I mean, that does make sense, because for a while we haven't gotten anything good from black belt for black belt jobs, so it seems like they just shoved it all into this one dungeon. Let's see what's in here. Fairy claws. Yeah, more black belt stuff. If you were rocking with a black belt in your party, this is this is the dungeon for you, I suppose. Wait, did I come up here? No, I don't think so. Oh, wait, that might lead me to the... Invincible, maybe? I don't know. All I know is that these guys are gonna have to... on an express... trip to hell. Uh... With Fyra. Let's go for a Cura. This? Oh, what? Only 800? Okay, whatever. Let's just go for that solely to just clean sweep. Beautiful. Alright. Man, if I see that dragon again, I will take every advantage of killing it every time I encounter it. Ooh. Oh, okay. Is there anything here? No? No treasure down there? Okay. we we'll just keep going and going. Alright. Down here again. Nothing, nothing else. God damn it. Alright. Let's keep going. I keep forgetting, I can run away if I really don't feel like fighting them. Ugh, these things again. <sighs> Alright, let's just go one Soul Eater. Wait. Cure. Have everyone guard. So that way, we could just clean sweep them with no problem. Oh, what? Really? Okay. Get out of here. Let's just go for you. Uh, Cura. Blazaga. And jump him. Hopefully he doesn't multiply. Because that would be really annoying. There we go. Okay. Let me just top off Lunith's health a bit. And let's keep going. Man, this place is really, 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 really long. Am I even... I don't even know if I'm going the right way or not. Okay, let's keep going. Ooh, these guys are new. Who are these? Silent us. Uh, why do we get the feeling that they want to put me... do silence on me? Let's go for this. Let's... I guess go for Fyraga. Uh, let's go jump. But hopefully Luna can just sweep with, uh... with Soul Eater. As soon as he gets a turn. <laughs> as soon as he gets a turn. Ah, didn't even... Didn't even have to. Alright, that's good. You know what, I can... I'm happy about that. Alright, let's keep going over here. Man, this place is really... They really are trying to drive home the point that you are... Hunting for this thing. Good lord. Oop, there it is. Oh man, we're on the invincible. Ooh, 
Ooh, look at that. It looks like they have shops here. Beds. Yep, this is this is definitely endgame, huh? Now, listen up. The stairs over there are the way to, out to the surface. When you want to board the invisible again, stand in its shadow and press the cross button. You'll see a exclamation point when you get near any mountains. Press the cross button to rev up the engines and propel us over the hills. Press the circle button to stop it and take a break. You can steer the ship again by standing at the helm. Did you take that all in? I think so. Good. Now, follow me. Put Gil in these thingies here. You can buy items, weapons, and even armor. I've also summoned Fat Joe Glow in the corner further aft. Where are you? Come on out, you chubby chicken. Doo doo. <laughs> Aww. So now we never have to worry about using the natural greens again. You can rest up in the beds over there, too. <laughs> Doga's calling me. I have to go. You're going already? Yes, I trust you to do the rest yourselves. Remember, go to the Cave of Shadows north of Amor and recover the Fang of Earth. Come to Doga's Manor once you get it. Doga and I must give you something before you continue on your journey. Good luck with the Fang of Earth. I'll see you in Doga's Manor. Ta-ta! Oh. Well, there she goes. Alright. But now we have the mighty airship, Invincible. So, as she said before, you can buy stuff here. You can get the ultimate black magic spell, Quake, Breaka, Breaka, uh, Drain Curaja, uh, Esuna, Reflect, which is really, really good. All these are really, really great spells. Uh, I think for here, Diamond, we get the diamond stuff, we get the Gaia Vest. Yeah, pretty much standard fare. Stuff that we haven't already collected or whatever. For items, we get a Dark Knife, Rune Axe, and a Dragon Lance. All good stuff. As you can see, we can sleep here now, so we never have ever, ever have to pay <laughs> for an inn ever again. Pretty much. Which is really, 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 really great. Think of it as like the Lunar Whale, if you've played Final Fantasy IV. Oh. So I can't go back to the ruins? Damn. Hope I didn't miss anything. I don't know if I missed anything, but that's okay. Oh, here she comes. There it is, our f mighty airship. Alright, so where are we? We're like in the middle of the sea. Yeah, okay, so I, I do want to go back to, uh... Oh, this thing is like a... Giant... <laughs> this thing is so sluggish. I want to see if I can go back to, uh... The ancient ruins so I can get my... Other airship back. can climb over here. But is this where I need to go? <laughs> Ooh. Where is it? Oh, damn it. I went all the way... I did not mean to do that. I went all the way back south. Alright, so I think it's... Right around here, yeah? There we go. I don't think I miss anything, but with that, uh, I'm going to end the episode off here. We got the Invincible. Uh, so in the next episode, we're going to go and get the last Fang that we need. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, comment, maybe subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys next time.